Hello, welcome to Talk of the Terrace with Nigel Winterburn and Jason Bird to every Premier League goal from yesterday and a look forward to Monday's Manchester derby. First though, Fernando Torres has hit form just a week before the FA Cup final against his former team. <laughs> Robin van Persie underlining just how crucial he is and has been to Arsenal all of this season. It's going to be a really interesting battle for fourth place, Nigel. Arsenal look, I think Arsenal will be looking over their shoulders a little bit well, and come back with a fantastic result as they did against Barcelona. They can still do it I think he was a made to me a few months ago. He said, you look at him, and he, he acts like a man who's walking down the street and ev everyone is looking at him. He thinks everyone is looking at him. And you know, third place isn't, isn't quite secure. But Spurs, although they looked like they were slipping away, they now sit, and I know they, they only won against Blackburn today and Blackburn in, in terrible run of form. But I think, uh, by the end of next week, uh, it will tell us a lot because obviously Tottenham go... Uh, Bolton in midweek away, which will be a different... But the way that they lost yesterday, what well, do you think? I thought they had a terrific chance. I always like to go with the teams that have got momentum, mm. no, no matter if they've got difficult games. But uh, I As I said, mm. actually, we've been playing well enough to get these kind of results for most of the season. It just hasn't been coming. Yeah, I mean, he's got some fantastic performances out of people like Moses and Maloney. Mm. But I think Talking about the, the form of Villa, they failed to score again yesterday. They're missing Darren Bent. Is scoring goals the reason why they're, they're struggling so I mean, much? The, the supporters didn't want him, and they're not happy with the style of football that, that Villa are playing. And it, it's difficult to see how that can be fixed, because certain mm. managers have certain styles. Yeah, well, Alex McLeish has obviously argued against that and said, look, like he perhaps was was sort of losing form and wasn't, the, wasn't the, the presence he was. Yesterday, the goals he scored were classic Kevin Davis goals, mm -hmm. and it looked like he was... That's why I talk about the momentum. Look at the teams that are winning games or picking up points. They're the ones... And, and, and the pressure is telling as well. It's interesting, Nigel talks about the kind of top and bottom. If you're going for the title and you don't come away with it, you go, oh, well, there's next year. Mm. But when you're... Blackburn, who, mm. if, if we believe what we read, Venkis didn't know <laughs> that relegation... Yeah. They've said that, you know, that they'd rather not be relegated, obviously, but, mm. but they have plans in place. Well, they have to, yeah. I mean, obviously, in the league, if they do go down, uh, Wolves, obviously, have got an owner who, who says he's committed to, to the club. You, look, you go to Molyneux nowadays, they're rebuilding the stands. Mm. Steve Morgan will, will try his, his damnedest mm. to get back up. But that, that danger of a free fall for a team is is always there. Is that something you think the players will be feeling the pressure of as well as I the... I think so. ...decision that uh, the owners have to make as well. Can they afford to keep those players for that year? Mm. With 